Yeah, that present experience is everything. So, um, when people ask me, you seem to like this song, how many times have you listened to it? And it's beyond count, yeah. it's so many, but it's not in mind that way. It's, it's like the first time, for the very first time. Yeah. I remember that song, feels like the first time, feels like the very first time. That's, the, for me, it's the way with relationships, with movies, and with music. So there's never a thought about have I heard this before or not, or how many times have I heard this, or all those are typical like egoic thoughts, but they're, it's not there. So there's really a full appreciation. You know, I'm listening to a song like a David Gates' song, The Guitar Man, and I'm just appreciating that David Gates voice, just the, just basking in it and and fully merge with it. And then oh, I mean the guitars start in there. They're just so beautiful. I just feel like I'm my heart just swells up in a symphony. And it's not about the lyrics either, about the guitar man. Uh, mm -hmm. And yet they're they're woven into it, like to the tapestry. So it's like uh, experiencing something for the first time, and there's so much appreciation with that. Mm -hmm. There's no comparison. I, just, I don't have any thoughts about other songs or other times or other places or what was happening when I first heard that song. You know, sometimes people will associate events and times and. I, I don't have that. I'm just like fully in it. It's like being there and, and hearing a symphony, you know, for the very first time and and having such a full appreciation of that. And that's really what our identity is too. It's 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 ever new. It d doesn't have any past reference to it. It doesn't have any comparison to it. It, it doesn't fit on the timeline happily and there's a sense of like soaring way beyond time and space and so to me music is like an ongoing meditation 